hello and welcome to the channel I'm Volcano AC and in this episode I will show you how to install Studio One DAW remember that Studio One allows you to install the same license key in five different devices at the same time I already have one of these licenses installed on my PC which is where I typically use this DAW I used to have another license on my old laptop but I removed it now I will be installing today this DAW in my new MSI Intel EVO laptop which I unboxed last week link to that unboxing video in the description below this will be a short video just to show you the very few steps on how to install this software so let's get started and here we are in our new MSI laptop so let's go ahead to our Google Chrome and now let's type my Presonus login and press on enter we can utilize this very first one over here to log in into our Presonus account I type my email and password click on login and now let me x out of this particular square box now let's view all and let's zoom in in the studio one package so click right on top of the package and you can see that i have hidden the key of my product but basically what we need to do in 2023 is click on the download installer for windows in my particular case and it's going to come down at the bottom left as you can see here all right now i go to my downloads double click and you'll see that i can start the installation process and it's gonna go very very quick and now that it's done I just click on finish and now it appears a new uh, icon in order to log into studio one directly I need to log in also into my account from here so I'll hide those credentials and you can see that it has been installed properly and I should mention that I do not have at this moment an audio interface connected however I just want to make sure the software is where it needs to be and you can see here it is so I'll X out of this one as well I'll make this big and um, let's start a new song and I'm just going to change the title of the new song and I'm going to name it test one and after that I will change the duration of this song to just one minute and now let's change the tempo to 100 bpm now let's click on ok right there and you can see that here it is I have all the functionalities uh, at least that's how it looks like let's put a track over here and it seems that is working well all right and that's all for this short video if there's anything in particular that you would like to know from studio one just put it in the comments below and I will try to make a video about it if you learn anything from this video don't forget to smash the like button and for more videos like this don't forget to subscribe all right Thank you for stopping by and I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.